Chapter 42 Diller wiped his sweaty palms on his jeans. He was nervous. He wasn't nervous about the success of the first part of the plan. As he'd left Clowntown, there had been a line of people at the car rental place. The rumour had spread exactly as hoped. He'd just double-checked on the way out that it hadn't morphed, but no, people were excitedly heading for Drake's Crossing. But shush, keep it to yourself. As he walked across the parking lot of the strip mall, he saw the Winnebago parked exactly where they said it would be. Sure, he couldn't technically drive, in the having a driver's license sense of the word, but he wasn't nervous about that either. Ever since they'd got back from the thing Smithy told Diller he wasn't allowed to talk about, Smithy had been giving Diller driving lessons in the taxi. It wasn't that hard, and he was a fast learner. All right, he'd never driven something the size of a Winnebago, but the principle was the same, and once he got out of the parking lot, it was a reasonably straight shot to where they were going. Getting arrested for driving without a license would suck, but compared to what came after this point, that possibility was really small potatoes. He reached the Winnebago and checked under the back wheel, finding the keys exactly where he'd been told they would be. Nor was Diller nervous about the rest of the plan, or his role in it. He was probably going to break the law at some point during the course of the day, but not that much. At least, not compared to what everyone else was doing. Besides, Diller was an incurable optimist. He was pretty sure that everything would work out fine. So no, he wasn't nervous about that either. He looked at the front door of the cab of the Winnebago and took a deep breath. He wasn't nervous. He was absolutely terrified. He opened the door and climbed into the driver's seat. He tried hard to keep his voice even, but it still cracked a little as he spoke. Hi there! From behind the firmly closed curtain to the back came an equally nervous-sounding female voice. Hi! Zoya's voice. <laughs>